Hey friends, welcome to the channel. Today I'm gonna to teach you how to play Goodness of God. It's a really simple way to play it, but then if you wanna go on and be able to learn how to play more advanced sounding pieces, make sure to check out our description. Uh, we have our whole course that you can take. Uh, let's get started. All right, Goodness of God in the key of G is a really beautiful piece. It is four chords, so that's as simple as it can be. Once you learn these four chords, you can play any single song in the whole world, which is really cool. So if you love this song and you wanna be able to go on and learn a lot of fun things about how to chord and how to accompany somebody, make sure to check out our course that I've developed. It's all online, it's all self-paced, and I'll have all the information in the description below. And make sure to also check out our basics to the piano video if you've never uh, touched a piano and you kind of want a little bit of a foundation because I'm assuming when I'm teaching this that you know a little bit about the keyboard. So let's get going. So we're gonna find a G note, first of all, by looking for a group of three black notes, you'll know they just repeat themselves kind of in a pattern. Okay, so we're gonna look for a group of three and a G note is tucked kind of in between there. So if we put our thumb on G and line up our fingers, one, two, three, four, five, we have G, B, D, which makes up our G chord, okay? It's just every other note. Really simple way to play a chord, okay? Then we're gonna look for a C. In our musical alphabet, it goes G, A, B, C. So let's play a C chord there, fingers one, three, five. Then we're gonna play a D chord, which is right after C, but we're also gonna pick up this black note up on the top, okay? So it's gonna make a, a shape of a triangle, essentially. D, F sharp, A. And then for E minor, you just move up one note from D, and there you go, E minor. So we go back to the G, C, D with that triangle shape, and then an E minor, okay? So if our right hand's playing the chords, I'm just gonna do it really simple for you and play a left hand single note. So let's line up our pinky on G, and we're gonna play a G right there, C in our second finger, D in our thumb, and then when we play that E minor every now and then, we're just gonna move open our thumb to play the E minor, right? G, A, B, C, D, E. So these just step up, C, D, E, pretty nice. Okay, so let's figure out how to bring these two hands together. This song is written in four, four time signature, so if you have a little bit of musical training background, um, you're gonna know that there's four beats to a measure. Okay, so for what I'm gonna do to simplify it is just we're gonna call it a together right rhythm. And that just means that when we bring the two hands together, we're gonna say together, right, together, right, together, right. So you can practice that over and over, just doing that rhythm, together, right. This is just a really basic way to play this so that you can at least start getting some foundation things um, under your belt. Uh, so let's play a C chord with a C note in our bottom hand, okay? And then we can just play the right hand by itself. C, right, together, right. Okay, then we're gonna find a D chord. Remember, it's a little uh, black note up here. Together, right, together, right. And then the E minor, one step up, together, right, together, right. And then we can go back to a G here or we can come up to the G here, it doesn't really matter. G, together, right. C, together, right, together, right. D, together, right, together, right, and E minor. Okay? All right, let's get started. You can just follow along. I'm gonna have the lead sheet for you to be able to print off below and I'll also show it while I'm playing so that you can watch. All right, let's go. I love you, Lord. Until I lay my head, I only went bum. So it went like this bum, bum, bum. From the moment that I wake up until I lay my head, I will sing of the goodness of God. Okay, so you'll uh, notice that sometimes I don't do that one to two ratio just because if I gotta get quickly to the next chord, they might share a measure. So if you have a little bit of musical training, that kind of makes a little bit of sense to you. But all right, let's go to the easy chorus. Again, so you can see that. And now my life, you have been faithful. 
goodness of God and I will sing of the goodness of God. All right, thanks for watching. Hope you loved it. Make sure to like this video and subscribe to our channel and drop a comment below if you want to hear more and, and let us know how you liked it. We'd love to connect with you. Uh, we'll catch you next time. Sing.